Hello to all of you. This is Dr. Tawal Mehta, and today we are going to discuss about filter operator in Rapid Miner. First of all, activate the Titanic data set here. Connect with the splines. You can press the play button and you can see the entire data set which is there. Now I want to do the filtration. So I'll activate the filter from here. Filter examples. I'll drag it and drop it in between. I'll activate the window. And I'll say I want the information only of the gender equal to. When I press this here, it will give me the options. So male and another entry, the passenger class. The passenger class equal to, so I can say first class, only give me the information of passenger class first class. I can again add the entry and this time I can select any of them. If I don't want another, uh, you can say op another condition, I'll remove this. Press OK and you can run. So it gives me only the information of the first class passenger meal. Now I can use this operator with the combination in aggregate also. So. I'll insert the aggregate tab in between and when I activate this, I want the average age so here the average age is there here male and first class passenger is there and got the error let me rectify the error. So basically, this error you will get when there is a mismatch between the second and third operator. Whenever you get the error, no need to worry. How we will resolve this error? First of all, let us understand. Double click on aggregate operator. Let us check. We want to have an average age. So activate the age here. Make sure you are having a continuous variable only because you want to compute the average operator. Click apply, then go and select attributes. Now, what the error was that in the filter example, we had included some of the variables like gender and passenger class, but we did not activate the same thing in aggregate, and therefore the process did not, uh, you can say, process the second operator was not passing the variables to the third operator. So, what we will do, those variables which are in filter example, I will activate in aggregate. So, I'll go and select attributes. The passenger class was here, gender was here, so I'll activate it again, gender and passenger class. Apply. I'll go in filter examples. So this thing we had already seen that the gender equal to male, passenger class equal to first class. Now what it will give me? It will give me the data, the age for all these combinations, average age for all these combinations which are there. So let me press this and you can see I got the answer only of first class, first class passenger male average age. Now there is a something which is known as invert the filter. So if I invert this filter, apart from the selection which is done as first, first class passenger male, it will give me the inverse of it. So when I run it, you can see first class female, second class female, second male, third female, third male. So this is uh, filtering according to the example by using the aggregate tab, tab in the combination. Now there is another type of filter. First of all, let me remove this. And let me write down here filter. Filter. range so here if i specify that only select 1 to 10 cases and then i'll press the run button so this the filtering is done according to the row number 1 to 10 only will be selected right or if i invert the filter so first 10 will be dropped and remaining will be selected this is the filtering operator in RapidMiner. 
Now, how to handle the missing observations with the help of filter operator in RapidFind? Let us remove all the operators and connect the original data set with, with the result, result tab. Press this play button. Let me go into statistics and let me see where are the missing observations. So age is having 263 missing observations. Cabin is having 1014. Now I want to deal with this. Is there any method? Let's see. So again, I'll activate the filter example. I'll drag it and drop it here. Double click on it. And I'll say is not missing. Only select those cases which are not missing. So we knew that in age, there are a lot of missing observations. So I'll press OK, run it. Now, when I'll go in statistics tab, let me check. You can see that, that age does not have any missing observations now. For more videos on Rapid Pioneer, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter. Please don't forget to press the like button. Thank you.